Hello Scorpio, how are you? I hope this finds you well. So we are going to be doing your weekly love reading and everything that you will need to know, whether it's about this reading or scheduling your personal readings, all of that is in the description box below for you. We are inviting your angels, spirit guides, and ancestors to come in and assist us with this reading today. All right, Scorpio, let's take a look and see what we have going on for you. The overall energy of your love situation, we have the Eight of Wands. Your energy showing up. We have the Star card in the reverse. And their energy, the person of, that you're dealing with or will be dealing with, we have the Two of Cups. All right, so it's it feels like just when you're giving up hope, Scorpio, and that's what the star card in the reverse feels like. I feel like you're recognizing that there's still some things that you need to work on or need to heal. We all do. We all have things that we're working on. We all have things that we, you know, are still healing from, Scorpio. But I feel like you're recognizing the things that you need to work on and recognizing the things that you need to heal. But I also feel that... There could be a specific connection that you're either still needing to heal from or that needs to be healed, okay? But I feel like you could be losing, you could be feeling a little bit down, you could be feeling a little bit hopeless in a situation, okay? Could be kind of losing hope when it comes to a certain person, a certain connection. Or maybe it's losing hope that you feel like you're never going to heal from something, okay? And I think it's normal to have fears like that. Healing can, sometimes it can take a while and it can be exhausting and it can be tiring. And sometimes it's just, you know, wishing it could be over, wishing it would move faster. Especially with this Eight of Wands being the overall energy. This could be like you wanting this like healing process to speed up. But it could also be some of you guys wanting some kind of communication, wanting some kind of direction, wanting to know where, you know, something is going and moving forward here. Now their energy showing up as the Two of Cups. To me, this does look like it could be a conversation. So whether it's through a, a phone call or a message that you're going to be receiving from somebody or whether they're wanting to like get together, like, hey, can we get together and talk? Hey, can we get together and like have a face-to-face? So somebody could be wanting to see you here, Scorpio. Somebody could be reaching out and asking if they can see you, if you guys can get together, if you guys can talk. Now we have the Three of Pentacles as the challenge. To me, this feels like Three of Pentacles can be a starting point, but it, these people are on the same page. Like they have plans here that they're working off of. They have come up with a plan. They're working towards the same creation right they're working together to build one thing and when this is coming up as the challenge it almost like puts it in the reverse and that makes it feel like you're not on the same page with somebody there has been somebody that you've had a hard time getting along with um, and that could just be because you guys are maybe are not quite working toward the same thing not wanting the same thing and it's just been very challenging okay so you could have had some fights with somebody here some falling outs just some just some discord for some of you and maybe you were hoping that somebody was going to reach out to you here and you felt like it wasn't going to happen. It does look like it is, Scorpio. But now the challenge of starting things back up again, but being on the same page. Is that something that we can do? Let's see. So we are going to be taking a look, Scorpio, at their feelings for you, at their intentions for you moving forward. We're going to be taking a look at their next actions towards you and a potential outcome. So they have the devil here. It's like even though they recognize that you guys may not be the best for each other, and sometimes maybe you guys bring out the worst in one another, Scorpio, but it does kind of feel like they feel a very strong attachment to you still. Like they still feel your energy when you guys are not together, but they do recognize where maybe there is some unhealthy aspects to this connection. And that could be because you guys are not working towards the same things or not wanting the same things. Somebody could have been kind of obsessing over things here, Scorpio. This could definitely be this person, you know, really kind of obsessing over the situation, things that were said, things that were done. Got the Page of Cups for their intention. So I do feel like somebody's planning on reaching out to you here, sending a message. This could definitely be an apology as well. 
they could be trying to keep it lighthearted, but I feel like I feel like there's a lot of intensity here. I think they just may be trying to keep it lighthearted. You got the Eight of Pentacles. So I feel like this could be somebody who's really focused on their work or maybe they're working on themselves. And they could just be reaching out and wanting to work on things with you as well. That the Page of Wands. I definitely feel like you're going to be hearing from somebody, okay? Now, some of you guys may have this person blocked or maybe you're just on guard when it comes to them. Because I feel like things have been the same between you and this person for a while. And maybe that just looks like it's been a pattern where you've just like you're noticing patterns with this person or things kind of like you come together. You guys talk for a while, you try and it kind of falls apart again and it keeps coming back to the same place. But yeah, I do see the full card here as well. Some of you guys could be, you know, there's a part of you that wants to have the courage to be able to take a chance on this. Because I feel like you do love this person, Scorpio. You do have a lot of feelings for them. If you guys have been waiting and hoping on some kind of communication or some kind of message from somebody, hoping somebody was going to reach out and want to get together, wanting to talk, I definitely feel like you're going to get that here. Even if you're just, if you're wanting that, you know, direction or some kind of closure, knowing where something is going to go moving forward, I think you're going to receive that here. So I feel like somebody could be apologizing. Absolutely. They could be wanting to come in and work on things. There could be kind of a new start between the two of you here, but I do feel like it is also important to remember the devil kind of energy that we do have here as well. I'm going to cover them up because YouTube is YouTube, but that whatever unhealthy aspects that are within you or within them or that are playing out in the connection to still bring awareness to them so they can still be worked through. But that is what I have for you, Scorpio. I hope that this helps you in some way. I would definitely expect somebody to be wanting to talk. Okay. If it resonates, let me know. If it doesn't, that's okay. Just check out your other placements. Everything that you'll need to know, whether it's about this reading or scheduling your personal readings, all of that is in the description box below for you. And if you want personal prayers for any reason, you can just be putting the little prayer emoji in the comments down below and I will go through and pray for you. But if this is where we part, thank you guys for being here and I will see you soon.